Good evening. I'm Nina Griffith. Thanks for joining us for WVUA 23 News. Our top story tonight, it's been a rocky ride on the nation's stock market this week. Stocks plunged again on Thursday for the second time in four days as the Dow Jones Industrial Average sank more than 1,000 points. The two best-known stock market indexes, the Dow and the Standard and Poor's 500, have dropped 10% from their all-time highs set last month. Stocks began to tumble last Friday after the Labor Department said workers' wages grew at, at a fast rate in January. Here in Tuscaloosa, a county court has cleared the way for the construction of a new extended stay hotel on McFarland Boulevard. The court ruled that a special exception be granted to allow for the construction of Town Place Suites, a five-story, 92-room hotel on the former site of Advance Auto Parts near the Springbrook neighborhood. While the site is zoned to allow a hotel, the special exception was required to allow the hotel to operate as an extended stay hotel. Construction should take about 16 months and the project cost is $12.5 million. The annual tree giveaway hosted by the city of Tuscaloosa is set for February 24th. The partnership with the Alabama Power Service Organization and the Alabama Forestry Commission allows for 5,000 bare root tree seedlings to be given away at the Tuscaloosa River Market from 8 a.m. to 11 a.m. on the 24th. City officials urge those wanting trees to arrive early that Saturday morning. The University of Alabama System Board of Trustees is considering a proposal to expand the university's nursing college building. The proposal is based on a demand for, the sp for space in the seven-year-old building that is no longer large enough to meet demand. Suzanne Prevost, Dean of the Cap Cap Capstone College of Nursing, says that the state of Alabama needs more nurses and that the number of students interested in the School of Nursing exceeds the college's current capacity. The plan calls for a $17.8 million addition to the current nursing school building. That's the news for now. I'm Nina Griffith. Thanks for watching and good night.